watch the screen and we'll compare here to the timing values and we'll see if we can figure out where maximum brake torque is gonna be at on our part throttle. And what we're gonna probably notice here, um, or what we're gonna notice is I'm, if I'm keeping my foot fixed that our spark timing as I walk it up, it's probably gonna jump a bunch, but as we get up to maybe 25, 30 degrees, I'm expecting it not to do a whole lot, but let's keep an open mind and try it and see what's gonna happen. talk about this real quick um, I obviously doubled almost doubled the values here as I was going up and gained about another 10 or 12 foot-pounds of torque but as I went higher in my timing it didn't really jump in torque that much I hit maximum brake torque so I just simply went and backed off the timing values so we can see we're here right around 25 30 degrees that's about where I expected to be at so what I'm going to do right now from 1500 to 3000 I'm going to use H I'm going to be blending it and then I'm going to take my table here from 3000 I'm going to paste it all the way into 10,000 and then I'm going to do another H. I'm going to do a blend. Now I'm expecting as I go up to maybe 5,000 that I might be able to run a little bit more spark timing part throttle. I don't know yet. And some of the table we're going to find down at the lower vacuum range from maybe negative 8 and below. We probably can run even more spark timing because there's less load there. We need to build out kind of the middle meat of the table here and uh, see how it's going to go. So let's do shift control C. Let's accept those modifications and then let's go here to 5,000 RPM and let's try it. Let me dial my dyno up here to 5,000. And again, same process. I'm just gonna go and dial the timing up a little bit and see if we can gain anything. I don't know, I'm expecting it probably might do a little bit more, maybe a couple more degrees. So let's go ahead and do a baseline. Let's just get on our throttle. Let's lock the throttle down, check out what the spark timing or what the uh, torque is gonna be showing us and then slowly walk the timing in.